We've started out with this concept of a grass labyrinth um, here at the garden. It's about 40 feet in diameter, if I remember correctly, and um, it's going to be an ongoing fluid and creative process. So little bits and pieces have been added here and there since the inception of the plans. Um, and we're looking at a long-term design with lots of different changes. It'll be an ongoing thing. So as you approach the labyrinth, you may not know what to do with it. Um, truly, there is no right or wrong way to experience a labyrinth. Um, just simply being on the path invokes this, this sense of mindfulness and peace and this idea of meditative movement. Meditative movement being something where we're moving and doing meditation at the same time and you don't actually have to try to do that. So simply walking the path and trusting that you will get to the center and back out again regardless of where it goes is part of the process. Um, we believe that the path also is a good um, analogy for life. So life has its twists and turns and you may think you're headed in the wrong direction when in, out in actuality if you stay on the path you will get where you need to go. So. Um, really a nice little metaphor for life, for healing, and for wellness. Wellness properties and benefits of walking a labyrinth include physical health, um, such as lower blood pressure, cholesterol, and stress, um, healing from <coughs> disease and disorder, and also um, just this general wellness property of being experience, of experiencing mindful, peaceful state of here and now, as opposed to worrying about the future or thinking about the past. Uh, the mental health benefits of the labyrinth are phenomenal. So when we talk about meditative movements are things like um, lowered symptoms of anxiety, depression, increased feelings of wellness, well-being, self-compassion, self-esteem. Just simply being here seems to be very good for people. 